Welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the astonishing transformations of some well-known stars. From dramatic changes to unexpected makeovers, you'll be amazed at how different they look now. Ready for some jaw-dropping reveals? Let's get started. British model Katie Price has been very open about the numerous plastic surgery procedures that have drastically changed her appearance over the years. However, she recently expressed regret over many of these procedures, admitting that at one point she felt like a monster. Katie has shared with media outlets that she underwent full-body liposuction, liposuction under her chin, and fat injections into her bum. I've met you, now I'm like... Oh shit, you said it's gonna get very deep, yeah. but we don't mind that. <laughs> One particular round of surgeries left her in need of a blood transfusion, but Katie was too scared of contracting COVID-19 to go through with it. Reflecting on her experience, she revealed that she had serious doubts afterward. Honestly, I've gone to hell and back. It was horrific. Oh my God, I look like a monster out of a horror movie. Katie also admitted that she has lost track of how many breast surgeries she has had, estimating the number to be around 12. She explained that she was all natural until she turned 30, but since then, she's had almost everything done in terms of cosmetic enhancements. If you want to explore the journey with me, please leave number one and watch this video until the end. Interesting things are waiting for you in the video. At 79 years old, Priscilla Presley shows little sign of aging on her face, yet she looks almost unrecognizable compared to her younger self. Many attribute this drastic change to a series of botched cosmetic procedures over the years. A few years ago, she revealed that she had low-grade silicone injected into her face, the kind typically used by mechanics for greasing car parts. This was done by a fraudulent doctor, Dr. Daniel Serrano, who was later imprisoned for his illegal practices. Yes, we actually, uh, as a joke, because I had, I had a couple of wigs, and, and I, at that time I had a granny outfit. And... A representative for Priscilla explained, Priscilla Presley was one of many documented victims of Dr. Serrano. An investigation into his misconduct led to his imprisonment. Ms. Presley dealt with this matter years ago, and everything is now well. Despite resolving the issue, some experts suggest that her puffy and waxy appearance might not be solely due to these injections. One doctor speculated that repeated laser treatments and Botox may be contributing to her current look. A commenter echoing public sentiment remarked, What has Priscilla Presley done to her face? It looks like she has a scary mask on halfway. These drastic changes continue to spark conversation about her transformation. Khloe Kardashian often faces the most criticism among her sisters for her cosmetic enhancements, as it seems her appearance changes frequently. Addressing the rumors about her plastic surgery, she told host Andy Cohen that she's only had one nose job and fillers, but has avoided Botox. Her transparency about the procedure sparked further discussion. Years earlier, on her talk show Cocktails with Chloe, she revealed that she had facial fillers dissolved. She explained, My face was so messed up I had to go and get this whole thing dissolved. It was a bummer, and now I'm afraid to do it again. I'm almost like, I swear things are still in my face. It's gonna be this far out. Oh. So now I'm just like, if my daughter outs me, I'm screwed. Oh. Despite her claims, some people remain skeptical as they believe her face has changed dramatically since then, leading to speculation that she may have had more work done than she's admitted. What's better than starting the day with a delicious cup of tea and watching this fascinating video together? 
Julie Chen Moonves, widely known as the host of the hit show Big Brother, made headlines in 2013 when she revealed on The Talk that early in her career, she decided to undergo eye surgery to make her eyes appear larger. When she was first starting out, agents told her that her Asian eyes wouldn't look good on TV, which ultimately led her to pursue the procedure. Oh, <laughs> wait, was it, um, was it exquisite? Was it different? Was it exquisite? They said, thank you. Despite the pressure to change her appearance, Julie has expressed no regrets about her decision. Speaking about the surgery, she shared, no one's more proud of being Chinese than I am. Every decision I've made got me to where I am today, and I'm not going to look back. This pivotal decision played a significant role in shaping her career, and her openness about it reflects her confidence and pride in her heritage, despite the challenges she faced. Kylie Jenner has undergone a noticeable transformation in recent years, and many believe she has had cosmetic procedures, possibly to resemble her sister Kim. After denying the rumors for months, Kylie finally admitted in 2016 that she had received lip fillers. Her fuller lips became a signature look, and she eventually opened up about it to the public. In a conversation with her sister Kim, Kylie revealed that at one point, she regretted how large her lips had become. She humorously admitted, Well, I definitely made my lips a little too big at one point, and added, Thank God I didn't end up on botched. Her transparency about this particular procedure was a rare moment of candidness in the face of ongoing speculation about her appearance. I like it. It's like the toast that I make for my kids that I grew up on. While Kylie has only confirmed her use of lip fillers, it's widely speculated that she has had additional procedures. Many believe she has received filler in her cheeks and chin, as well as undergoing a Brazilian butt lift and breast implants. Donatella Versace gained fame by running the high-end fashion brand Versace alongside her late brother, Gianni. Over the years, as she's remained in the public eye, her appearance has changed drastically, with many suggesting that it has taken a turn for the worse. Her nose and lips in particular have undergone significant transformation, leading to widespread speculation and landing her on nearly every worst plastic surgery list. That with very, very defined roots in Italy because of the manufacturing. Despite the rumors and media scrutiny, Donatella has only ever admitted to using Botox and has not acknowledged any other cosmetic procedures. She has also not expressed any regrets regarding her altered appearance. When asked about her evolving look, she once remarked, I'm not like this genetically. I use tons of cream and take care of my hair and skin. Her refusal to admit to anything beyond Botox continues to fuel speculation, but Donatella remains confident in her choices and continues to be a prominent figure in both fashion and beauty. Ronnie Ortiz Magro, a former star of Jersey Shore, was known for his chiseled abs but over time, he found it difficult to maintain his famous physique. In 2019, after welcoming his daughter Ariana, Ronnie revealed that he underwent liposuction to enhance his six-pack. Appearing on The Doctors, he explained that having a baby changed his life, leaving him without time to spend hours in the gym as he once did. To maintain his desired look, he opted for laser high-definition liposuction. How are the VMAs? So awesome. Oh man, they were amazing. <laughs> the procedure helped define his abdominal area, allowing him to regain his sculpted six-pack. 
Ronnie's transparency about the cosmetic procedure highlighted the pressures of maintaining a fit appearance while adjusting to fatherhood. If you like this video, please donate me $2. I will reward the staff who made this interesting video. Larissa Lima, the 90 Day Fiancé star, revealed a completely transformed look in September 2020 after reportedly spending $72,000 on cosmetic enhancements. These procedures included a nose job, liposuction, breast and butt augmentations, among others. Yes, uh, I meet him on Tinder. He's really sweet, 26 years old, so... She openly discussed her surgeries on an episode of 90 Day Fiancé Happily Ever After, saying, I lose weight, I did butts make it bigger, I did Botox, I did my nose, I did my lips, I did my cheekbones, I did my chin. I'm a new woman, and I feel very happy with all the cosmetic enhancements. Larissa's dramatic transformation left her nearly unrecognizable compared to how she looked before the show, marking a significant change in her appearance. David Letterman, once known for his clean-cut appearance during his long and successful career on TV, has undergone a surprising transformation since retiring. He's now sporting a full, long beard, which has drawn plenty of attention and led many to joke that he'd make the perfect Santa Claus. His new look has become the subject of many headlines, highlighting just how different he appears. This hotel I've ever stayed in in my life, I'll be here through Christmas. <laughs> One notable moment came when Queer Eye's Jonathan Van Ness, known for his expertise in grooming, did a segment where he tried to tame Letterman's impressive beard. It was a fun and memorable moment, showcasing how Letterman's new style has become part of the conversation in pop culture. In addition to the beard, Letterman has adopted a much more relaxed style overall. Gone are the days of his famous suit and tie. Now he's often seen in comfortable sweats, embracing a laid-back look that contrasts sharply with the polished image he once had on television. Mickey Rourke, the Oscar-nominated actor, has undergone significant changes to his face since his early days in the spotlight and much of this is due to his past as a boxer. His face sustained multiple injuries from boxing fights, leading to extensive reconstructive surgeries. In a 2009 interview with the Daily Mail, Rourke explained, most of it was to mend the mess of my face because of boxing, but I went to the wrong guy to put my face back together. Are you there? <laughs> uh, too heavy for you, baby. <laughs> He revealed that he had his nose broken twice, underwent five surgeries on his nose, and had one operation on a smashed cheekbone. These injuries and the subsequent surgeries dramatically altered his appearance, making him almost unrecognizable compared to his younger days in Hollywood. In 2015, a source told Page Six that Rourke was planning to go back into the operating room to fix his nose again, as well as to get new dental implants. Despite his many surgeries, Mickey Rourke continues to work in Hollywood, dealing with the lasting effects of both his boxing career and the surgeries that followed. The late Joan Rivers, a comedy legend, was known not only for her sharp wit, but also for being remarkably open about her many cosmetic procedures over the years. Some of the surgeries she admitted to include a facelift, neck lift, and eyelid surgery. Despite her humor and openness about the subject, her life came to a tragic end at the age of 81 due to complications from a cosmetic procedure.
Her daughter, Melissa Rivers, reflected on this heartbreaking loss in her memoir, The Book of Joan Tales of Mirth, Mischief, and Manipulation. In the book, Melissa revealed that Joan had undergone 340 cosmetic procedures throughout her lifetime, driven by a deep sense of insecurity about her appearance. Melissa also discussed her mother's passing during an appearance on The Today Show, explaining that the complications arose during a throat surgery and saying, in my opinion, it was 100% preventable. She later filed a lawsuit against the clinic, accusing them of being unprepared and unprofessional, a move that underscored the painful circumstances of Joan Rivers' death. If you don't like this video, give me $2 and comment below. I will punish the people who created this content. Simon Cowell shocked fans when he appeared at the red carpet for the America's Got Talent quarterfinals, looking almost unrecognizable. His dramatically altered appearance sparked widespread discussion in the media. On the Absolute Radio Breakfast Show, host Dave Barry humorously remarked, I remember Simon Cowell when he had his first face. I've known him a long time, but the current one is a bit slipknot. It's actually quite terrifying. Barry went on to joke that the surgery must have been done in the dark for it to turn out so poorly, adding that a man with Cowell's wealth should have hired the best surgeon in the world. His comments echoed the surprise and confusion many felt upon seeing Cowell's new look. Following Cowell's appearance, Dr. Neela Raja, a leading cosmetic doctor, weighed in, suggesting that he had likely gone overboard with Botox. She commented, I suspect Simon's fallen complexion is a combination of weight loss and too much Botox. Fans and experts alike remain intrigued by the extent of his transformation. Heidi Montag, the reality star who rose to fame on the hills, transformed from the girl next door to a Hollywood Barbie after undergoing a series of plastic surgery procedures that left her nearly unrecognizable. In a highly risky move, she had 10 procedures done in a single day, including a brow lift, nose job, liposuction on her stomach and thighs, and a butt augmentation. I was like, we need a code word. <laughs> <laughs> like you put it down. So actually, I thought I was going into labor. Despite the initial excitement, Heidi later revealed that she regretted her decision. The surgeries caused significant health issues as her body struggled to cope with the stress of so many procedures. In a 2013 interview with Us Weekly, she shared, I just didn't realize what I was really signing up for. It just sounds so minor when you have a surgeon describing so much of it to you, like, okay, great a little of this, a little of that. You're not told the recovery time, the mental strain it will put on you in the long term. Her candid reflection on the physical and emotional toll of cosmetic surgery serves as a cautionary tale about the realities of such extreme transformations. Paul Stanley, the legendary frontman of KISS, looks noticeably different now compared to the band's height of fame, sparking speculation about possible cosmetic procedures. It's rumored that he's undergone a nose job, facelift, along with other fillers and Botox. Some also believe he may have had an eyebrow lift and lip enhancements. That's not, you know, that, that's, not, that's not the fairy tale. It doesn't, it doesn't end there. Despite the rumors, Stanley has only admitted to one procedure, reconstructive surgery. He underwent this surgery because he was born with a condition called microtia, which resulted in him not having a right ear. This is the only cosmetic-related surgery he's openly discussed.
During an interview with Sirius XM's Jim and Sam, Stanley also mentioned that he's had his rotator cuffs repaired, a hip replacement, and cartilage surgery in his knees. However, he made it clear that none of these procedures were related to altering his appearance. Actress Nikki Cox was one of the hottest stars on TV in the late 1990s and early 2000s. But her career faded after a series of cosmetic procedures left her with a dramatically altered appearance. The most noticeable changes were her larger lips and tighter face, which became the subject of much speculation. In 2013, paparazzi photos of Nikki surfaced, revealing a much different look than the one fans had grown accustomed to on screen. Many media outlets labeled her as botched and unrecognizable. One plastic surgeon weighed in on her transformation, suggesting that Nikki may not have undergone surgery, but rather had botched filler injections. He speculated that the drastic change in her appearance was likely the result of excessive fillers rather than going under the knife, further fueling the discussion around her altered look. Despite the media attention, Nikki has remained private about her cosmetic decisions. Dolores Catania, star of The Real Housewives of New Jersey, has been open about undergoing several plastic surgeries since becoming a public figure. She admitted to having a tummy tuck, breast augmentation, facelift, liposuction, and a Brazilian butt lift, which transformed her appearance over the years. Mad at somebody I was on. I don't want to relive the things that I went through back then. Yeah, I so, get that. However, Dolores revealed that these procedures caused tension in her relationship. Her boyfriend initially did not support her decision to undergo so many surgeries. On the Getting Real with the Housewives podcast, she explained, he was really angry. He was so mad at me and he didn't let up on it. Despite the strain, Dolores eventually stood her ground, telling him, I let him be mad for a little while and then I had to say, listen, you either live with it or we just have to move on. Her transparency highlights the personal challenges that can come with cosmetic procedures. Shia LaBeouf has undergone numerous style transformations over the years, some so drastic that at times you might not even recognize him. He started with his familiar child actor look from Even Stevens, but as he transitioned out of child stardom, his appearance shifted dramatically. He's grown long beards, buzzed his hair, and everything in between, constantly changing his look. Character, he wasn't like too enthused about me playing him, you know? Uh -huh. uh, I don't know how you are with your dad or how you guys are with your his fashion choices have also sparked plenty of conversation. From wearing bright pink leggings and Uggs to showing up in just underwear, his bold style has always kept people talking. One of his most infamous moments was when he appeared on the red carpet with a paper bag over his head that read, I'm not famous anymore. While his ever-evolving appearance has left many surprised, one thing is clear, Shia LaBeouf's confidence to pull off these looks is unmatched. Aubrey O'Day has recently gone viral on social media after fans compared her Instagram photos to some recent paparazzi shots, and the difference between the two is shocking. The paparazzi photos, taken as she walked her dog, marked the first time she'd been seen in public since October 20th, 19, and she was nearly unrecognizable, especially compared to the highly edited images she posts on Instagram, where her body appears to have an entirely different shape to be for so long and I a random girl in Palm Springs Aubrey clapped back at the paparazzi photos claiming they were doctored however just days later she was spotted at a pool looking very similar to the unedited paparazzi photos 
It was confirmed to be Aubrey as other pool guests overheard her mentioning her name multiple times. To clarify, this isn't about shaming her appearance, but rather about addressing the potential issue of her heavily photoshopping her Instagram photos and not being honest about it. Dolly Parton, beloved by fans for her openness and charm, has never shied away from talking about the changes in her appearance over the years. She's been candid about her cosmetic enhancements and proudly embraces her look. In a 2019 interview with CBS Sunday Morning, she famously remarked, It's true that I look artificial, but I believe that I'm totally real. My look is really based on a country girl's idea of glam. I wasn't naturally pretty, so I make the most of anything I've got. Over the years, Dolly has admitted to undergoing numerous cosmetic procedures, including a facelift, eye surgery, breast implants, liposuction, excess skin removal, lip injections, and Botox. Her honesty about these procedures has only endeared her more to her fans as she takes pride in crafting her signature look. At the age of 78, Dolly continues to stun with her timeless appearance. The late Jackie Stallone, mother of A-list actor Sylvester Stallone, openly expressed her plastic surgery regrets during a 2013 interview. When asked about the work she'd had done, she candidly replied, I do, and actually I've gotten too much. I look like I've got a mouthful of nuts. It's Uvederm. Too much of it. I feel like I look like a chipmunk. She went on to explain that Uvederm had plumped her cheeks, making it appear as though she had a mouthful of walnuts. Married to the same sign as the boar, unless they're in a different deckhand. Jackie also shared that she had undergone around three chemical peels and received about 50 injections throughout her lifetime. Interestingly, she never tried Botox, claiming that she naturally didn't have wrinkles on her forehead. Despite her regrets, Jackie expressed her belief in plastic surgery, but had strong opinions about Beverly Hills surgeons, calling them overrated hacks. Instead, she sought out doctors in other states, saying she didn't trust the surgeons in Beverly Hills to perform her procedures. The late Kenny Rogers made the decision to undergo cosmetic surgery, which drastically altered his appearance and had a significant impact on his confidence. In a 2012 interview with CBS host Gail King, he admitted, I was trying to hide myself. I had the money to do it and I had time off. Rogers explained that it was one of those moments when you look in the mirror and wonder if you could improve your appearance by making certain changes. However, he added that he regretted undergoing the procedures and often wondered what he would have looked like if he hadn't done them. Rogers also emphasized that while the surgeries didn't affect his music or singing voice, they deeply affected his confidence to perform on stage. In fact, he canceled some shows during his 2018 farewell tour, citing health issues that some speculated were linked to his surgeries. One of his most regrettable procedures was a botched eyelid lift, which he spoke openly about in 2006. Reflecting on the surgery, Rogers said, I'm not happy about it. It drives me crazy. Sharon Osbourne has always been very candid about her use of cosmetic procedures. In her 2013 memoir, she even declared that she was done with surgery for good. However, that changed in 2019 when she revealed she had undergone yet another facelift, her fourth one to date. Sharon's relationship with cosmetic surgery has been extensive and well-documented.
In 1999, she underwent gastric bypass surgery, leading to a weight loss of over 100 pounds. Following that, she spent $120,000 on various procedures, including a facelift, tummy tuck, eye lift, abdominoplasty, liposuction, and Botox. In 2007, she admitted that by then, she had spent approximately $530,000 on cosmetic surgeries. No, he wouldn't talk to me. You he's, don't think he would talk he's to He's too busy talking to, um, what's that guy's name? John Legend. Sharon has always been open about her willingness to undergo these enhancements. She's famously said, There's not much I haven't tweaked, stretched, peeled, lasered, veneered, enhanced, or removed altogether. Her numerous procedures have undeniably led to a dramatic transformation in her appearance over the years. Aaron Carter, once a beloved child star and teen heartthrob known for his hit singles, experienced a dramatic change over the years, much like many child stars who struggled to maintain their early success. After battling substance abuse for several years, Aaron found himself in the spotlight again due to legal issues involving his family. To those who remember him from his early days, his appearance is now nearly unrecognizable. Aaron has adopted a rougher exterior, with numerous face tattoos and piercings, which starkly contrast his youthful image from his teen years. Despite these changes, one thing has remained consistent, his signature bleach blonde hair, which fans loved about him back then and still recognize today. We did a, we did a little spoof thing for Spike TV. Oh, uh, okay. Like, uh, called The Rematch. Though his transformation has surprised many, Aaron Carter's journey has been a reflection of his personal struggles and growth. His iconic blonde hair remains a reminder of the star he once was, and perhaps a connection to the person he's always been. Lisa Rinna, star of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, is famous for her signature pout, which she achieved with the help of fillers. However, she has had some cosmetic procedures that she deeply regrets. One such experience involved Botox, which she says left her looking totally botched. Lisa explained that she decided to get Botox in her cheeks because many of her friends were doing it, and she wanted to give it a try. However, after seeing the results, she was horrified, saying, I saw a photo and I was like, oh, Jesus, that's not good. That is not good. Wait a second. Why do you say that? I say that because I was at a point in my career where that just rejuvenated. From that experience, Lisa learned that when it comes to cosmetic enhancements, less is more. While she still appreciates Botox, she now avoids anything that might alter the natural shape of her face. This shift in perspective has guided her approach to maintaining her signature look. Michaela Romanini, once celebrated as one of Italy's biggest stars and hailed as one of the most beautiful women in the country, has undergone a dramatic transformation over the years due to numerous cosmetic procedures. Once known for her stunning appearance, she is now almost unrecognizable from her former self. While the exact procedures she's had remain unclear, her lips, eyes, and skin have visibly changed, drawing significant attention. Some media outlets have even gone so far as to claim she looks alien-like due to the drastic alterations. Despite the harsh criticism surrounding her appearance, Romanini reportedly has no regrets about the surgeries she's undergone. In fact, some reports suggest that she has become addicted to cosmetic procedures, particularly collagen lip injections.
Thank you for watching my video. There are many other interesting things in the next videos. Please look forward to it. Thank you and goodbye.